Hey guys and welcome to another video. While I was trying to update my Nvidia graphics card driver on my older laptop, I ran into a strange error. The installation can continue, coupled with an even less descriptive message, an error has occurred. I will walk you through all the steps I did in solving this issue, so hopefully this helps you upgrade your graphic card driver. Before proceeding, make sure you close down any other apps and save your documents. Since I initially tried to upgrade from within the GeForce Experience app, the next logical step was to perform a manual installation by downloading the drivers myself. Open up your favorite browser and head over to the NVIDIA website on the driver download page. The link is in the description. Look up your GPU model and operating system and then proceed with the download. In my case it was about 800 megabytes of download, so downloading can take a while depending on your internet connection. Strangely enough, the version that I was recommended by the GeForce Experience app was much older than the one I was able to download from the website directly. It could be that this was an attempt from their side to perform a step-by-step -step update, but it seems this was not working. Once the drivers are downloaded, since they come in the form of an executable file, just run the file. A window will pop up asking you where you wish to unpack the drivers to. You can leave the default location on, but no matter what you choose here, please remember this folder as you will need it later on. Go ahead and unpack the drivers. Their installation will proceed as soon as they are unpacked. If you're having trouble with the compatibility check of the drivers you downloaded, please go back to the NVIDIA website and select the correct drivers for your device and your operating system. I went for the custom installation since I wanted to select the option of performing a clean installation. This option resets all of your settings to defaults and removes your profiles, but when you're having trouble with your drivers, I think this is the way to go. The process went ahead with uninstalling the previous version. However, in my case, during the uninstall process, my computer hanged and I had to reboot it. If this happens to you, let's move on to the next step, the manual update of the driver. Once the PC boots back, right-click on the Windows Start button and select Device Manager. Within the Device Manager, look up Display Adapters, expand it and look up your GPU in that list. Double-click on it and on the window that opens up, go to the Driver tab. Next, click on the Update Driver button and a new window should pop up asking you where to look up those drivers. Select Browse my computer for drivers and then go to the folder where you unpacked the NVIDIA drivers earlier on. You don't need to go all the way through all the subfolders, just make sure you are checking the Include Subfolders checkbox. Once you located the folder, click on Next. Windows will search the folder and then proceed with the installation of the drivers. In my case, even this manual installation resulted in a computer hang, therefore I had to perform one more step, meaning completely uninstalling the device itself. Don't worry, it's not as dramatic as it sounds. For basic tasks, your computer uses the integrated display driver, the HD Graphics 4600 in my case, so disabling the GPU should not affect you at all. Here is how to do it. Open up Device Manager again and look up your GPU adapter. Before we can go ahead with the uninstallation of the device, we should first disable it, just to make sure we can uninstall it. Right-click on the GPU and select Disable Device. A new window will pop up to ask you to confirm it. Go ahead and click Yes. Reboot your computer if it hangs again, otherwise just go back to the Device Manager, right-click on your device and select Uninstall Device. A window opens up asking you to confirm the action. Make sure you also check the attempt to remove the driver for this device option. Once the GPU is completely uninstalled, click on the Scan for Hardware Changes button on the top bar of the Device Manager. It sometimes takes a few seconds for the Device Manager to show you the adapters in the list, so give it some time before scanning again if it doesn't show immediately. Once it does, right-click on it and select Update Device. Same as before, give it a few seconds for the menu to appear. Proceed with the same steps we did before, going to the NVIDIA folder and selecting the Include Subfolder option as well. If during the installation you get a window, like I did, saying that this driver is not signed, you should go ahead and select Install this driver anyway. This time the process should go ahead and you should see a message saying that Windows has successfully updated your GPU drivers. Close this window and do a final check in the Device Manager. Double click on your device and go to the Drivers tab. It should now show the new driver version and date. 
So this is it guys, I hope this was useful for you and that you're having now a GPU driver running the latest drivers. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe. As always, if you're having trouble, leave a comment and I'll try to help you out. Have fun!